All right. I know. He already is named. <gasps> Real quick, gotta get some stuff. We might. All right, so this is my West African. Because he knows it. Cute man. Perfect. Looks pretty snuggly. Oh, we're home. Hello, Martin. How are you, sir? Oh, he's so cool. He loves your little pouch. You know? She is not happy today. She's all right. What is up, guys? How the heck are you doing today? You know the drill. It's your boy Tyler Nolan. We got another sweet episode coming at you today. I'm pretty excited about it. Let's let's get right to it. So, yesterday, my day off, um, we went and picked up another snow anaconda. This was a local breeder in Wellington, just about maybe 30 minutes north of my house, Armando and Jenny. Guys, thank you so, so, so much. Sold me one of their 2020 hognose snakes. He's a snow conda, so I'm gonna be able to use him for my other two snow females that I have eventually for Eslin one day. But dude, he's such a really cool snake. His name is Martin. He's got a really cool personality. Gianna was holding him all day yesterday. She even had him in in her little pouch on her freaking on her little romper, and he just like stayed there all day. Super, super cool little snake. We're gonna feed him real quick. Just to make sure, because yesterday was Sunday and every all their males eat on Sunday. So he's the only one that didn't eat yesterday. So we're going to feed him real fast. Then my Gaboon Viper just shed. So we're going to take her out in just a second and show you guys what she looks like. Because today I'm doing a tattoo of a Gaboon Viper. Neo Trad, my style, my version of a Gaboon Viper. We're going to head over to the shop, get this thing drawn up for my client. He's going to be here at one. We're going to get it tattooed. It's going to be a super sweet, fun day. But first, let's feed this little hog no snake and just make sure he takes a meal. All the hoggies. So I have everybody set up in here. See, it's just like a rack system in here. Got everybody lined up. Let's see. Okay, so here is Martin. He's the new guy. Hey, dude. Would you like Would you like a meal today before I go to work, sir? Oh, yeah? Ow! Hey! Don't go for my hand! He keeps going for my hand! Ah! Dude! Come on! These guys are so funny. Such funny little eaters. Come on, eat it! Eat it! Get it! Get it! Get it! Ah! Oh, my God! He keeps going for my fingers. Such an aggressive little eater look at that face though oh god hognose snakes are so freaking cute a lot of people are making fun of me for having them now but i don't really care because i love them all right so this is my west african gaboon viper she is a absolute badass just look at the pattern on this snake such a really really cool girthy thick snake huge head insane venom yield and the largest fangs out of any venomous snake in the world the only other snake with larger fangs than the gaboon the second largest is that mangshan down there those two that i have also huge huge fangs designed for taking down prey check that out so hopefully when i'm tattooing today I can really figure out a nice way to get that pattern. Just, dude, look at how sick it is. It's crazy. All the chevrons and the triangles and the rectangles up top. Dude, she is not happy today. She is so mad. Woo! She is a looker. All right, so now that you saw the Gaboon Viper, let's head over to the shop. I have to get drawing. I gotta get some coffee. My client's gonna be here. And let's have some fun today tattooing. I am stoked. I love doing cool ideas like this. Doing a Gaboon Viper today. The last Gaboon Viper I did, I was gonna film and I didn't get a chance to. So today we are definitely making a Gaboon Viper video. And a lot of people on my channel have been asking about the Gaboon lately. So this works out perfect. My client was like, yo, I want a Gaboon Viper today. I was like, hell yeah. Perfect timing. So here you go, guys. The Gaboon Viper freaking tat video all right here we are sunshine stay tattoo deerfield beach florida let's get inside 
and get ready for work. Got the weenies. It's getting really hard holding both of these guys at the same time. You guys are getting heavy. You here we go. Home away from home. Be free, weenies. Yay! All right. First one here. Check this place out. All right, let's get cracking. There's my new station. Let's get to work. All right, so check it out. So my buddy, we're doing, I already tattooed. I tattooed a gator on the inside of his arm. Um, and I did something else on the outside. I'm pretty sure it's like an insularis or something. I don't know. We're going to find out here in a minute. I just forgot. I've tattooed so many freaking snakes on people. I just don't remember what's what. So um, Gaboon Viper. We've got a little Gaboon mock-up here trying to, uh, the pattern on these guys is freaking insane. All the chevrons and all the all the all the stripes, all these like baby purple stripes and triangles, and it's pretty serious. We're doing some filigree around it right now to kind of give it some some more motion, um, and kind of just you know make it look pretty cool. Do some leaves and stuff, kind of cap off this end part, and then we will show you how we are going to place it on my homie's arm today. This is gonna be super dope. I'm very, very pumped. The last Kaboon Viper I did, I really wanted to film and get really good pictures of. Wasn't able to do that. So today we are making up for all of that. This is pretty much what I got going on here for like the actual, just like basic layout of the tattoo. So it's gonna go on the inside of his arm, Kaboon Viper bicep part. His bicep is gonna be pretty much right here armpit up here this is going to be the back part of his arm so this will kind of cap everything off nicely gaboon viper will stick out the side right on the inside of his bicep and then this will be down where his elbow is so pretty cool let's get this stencil made all right turn your freaking light on what up dude how's it going it's cracking let's show the world what we did on you already richard relax all right so last time we did this gator hell yeah healed really cool so like what i you'll see what I, the gaboon here in a second kind of this like filler stuff these this leafage this is that blue insularis that i did too cool man i mean dude these c colors on you look great still for considering how tan you are it looks really good all right so now i'm going to show you that gaboon so let's see the size i just flipped it because I had it for the other arm for some reason. But the way that I designed it is to fit right in that space, right there. So that's perfect. Like the way that the head is positioned, the body with your bicep, that is perfect. All right, so let's get you shaved. All right, I am pumped. Dude, this thing is gonna fit perfect right here too. There we go. Nice. All right, buddy, you ready? Let's get it. Let's get it. Starting with the top. This thing is gonna be so sweet. How you feeling, bro? Wonderful. Not that bad? No? Cool. No, up here a little bit. But yeah, up by the armpits no. a little. A little spicy but not too bad bro so you see all of these lines in here are done with a gray wash just so that they're barely in there so that way i have the pattern down and then i'm just going to pretty much shade from that get the pattern blocked in and then we're going to color it so right now i'm about to bust out some mags and do all of the shading on this bad boy oh what we got here dude hey what's up bud everybody meet Ulysses. He's the newest member here at Sunshine State. So go out well, here with Buck at your phone so nobody sees what oh. you're talking about. <laughs> Shit. So I'll put all Ulysses' information right down here. Go check him out on Instagram and get a sweet, oh my God, I'm falling. Get a sweet tap from him. Oh yeah. Ooh, all right. She is coming to life. How you doing there, buddy? Hanging in there. Hanging in there? A little spicy? A little bit. We're getting there, man. We're like almost done with all the dark stuff of the snake, all the browns and stuff. 
and then uh, we're gonna start doing, I'm gonna do the leaves real quick, finish this background piece, and then we're gonna do all like the purples and all the super light stuff in the thing. So honestly, not, not too much left. Oh yeah. All right, so let's just take a look at how it looks with just the browns in it. Nice. So now I'm gonna get the grays, the purples, and these light tans in here. Greens in the leaves and some bright yellow up here. So maybe like another hour left. How you doing, bro? Pretty good. We're getting there. Yeah. I know, it's probably tender. But dude, it's just because, dude, look at this pattern. Like the pattern is just freaking crazy on this thing. And this is still like all the tan colors. I'm still finish up these finishing up these like chevrons and stuff up here. And then we're gonna throw that we're gonna throw that purple in there and give it that white head. And bro, even it looks pretty sweet now. Even with just those couple little additions is gonna look totally different. And then we will be finished. So close, dude. This thing is looking pretty bitchin if i might say i know you're probably so sick of it right you're over it done yep yeah yep i'm good to go i mean how long has it been we started what what time we start one yeah it's seven it's what seven fifty seven fifty yeah we put it put in the work today but dude this thing is sick so i'm almost done just finishing up the white right now I'm going to uh, spray it down with some Bactine. Bactine has a little bit of lidocaine in it, so it helps bring the bring the blood away and chill it out. Makes it feel really nice, too. Bactine for you guys out there. Wrap it with Saran Wrap. Let it sit for like 15 minutes, and then I'll show you guys what it looks like here in just a second. Woof! We are finish. Wow very cool now you see how less pissy it is now that we put some bactine on it check this out pretty freaking intricate pattern super cool dope little neo trad rendition gaboon viper to match the rest of this stuff so now the next thing that we do is going to be the mang shan. And the mang, we're going to probably fill up this whole back part of the arm with that. But, dude, super cool, man. I'm pumped on that. You approve? Definitely. Dope. Hell yeah, man. Come on. What is your problem? Come on. Nobody even got to see the last one. Why not? Because, um... So something happened to my camera. I did a, uh, what tattoo was that? Remember what it was? It was cool. I don't know, something I tattooed the other day was really cool. Um, filmed a bunch and something happened with my phone or something. Like the picture was all weird on it. The audio wasn't there. It sucked. Filmed all day, super cool tattoo. Really wanted to share it with you guys. And I couldn't share it with you. And Renee did such a killer, such a killer intro. It was like, dude, you <laughs> crushed it. So now you gotta crush it again because they didn't even get to see that use, outro. Use that one. <laughs> no, I can't. This is, it's gotta be, it's gotta be genuine. It's gotta be today. You know what I mean? So here you go. Without further ado, guys, <laughs> the ultimate Renee outro. Nope, watching. you gotta start over again. Get hype, man. Let's go. Hi, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for watching. What do they do? Come on, what do they do? <laughs> Like, comment, subscribe, uh -huh. follow us on Instagram, Sunshine State Tattoo. Check out Renee's Instagram, get tattooed by her. <laughs> Check out Tyler's Instagram, Tyler Nolan Tattoos. Check out Rich's Instagram. I'm just kidding. Rich doesn't have an Instagram. And check out the merch shop, TylerNolanTattoos.com. The merch shop? The merch <laughs> website. Oh, you killed it. Uh, she's great, isn't she? All right, guys. Guys, we're both, our voices, both of our voices are cracking. Fish tank's powered down. It's late. It's been a long day. Richard, Travis, we're leaving. Gianna cooked dinner. It's going to be interesting. Let's uh, see how it is tonight. All right, guys, until next time. Hope you enjoyed today's video.
but they never really understand me. I need a comma like I need a Grammy. She lays the flow with her designer panties. Yeah, we eatin' plenty. Check the pantry from the sound waves to the rebel lines. From the tattered bridges to expensive dishes. Now we eating ends with these new beginnings. Yet the sign a major for the bank roll. But thank the Lord that it dies at penitentiary. Nice guy, but my inside is empty. I'm mighty flashy with a bird's eye. Scribble gems to get my pockets lined till I get arthritis. Switch my heart is icy. Walking past the bouncer like I knew somebody. Queen like Helen Cloudy or the poison ivy. But from like a stroller with a coast.